Hello, you're welcome. Here to solve for hex in this algebra problem. Solution from here, we can rewrite eight x here as two times four x, which is all square here minus four x all raised to power three. Now equals to three from here. And here from the law of indices a times b raised to power n this is same thing as a raised to power n times b raised to power n at this here let's use this power of 2 to open this so this gives us 2 square times 4x all square then minus we still leave this as 4x or raised to power 3 then equals to 3 from here and here we have four two square here that's four that's four times four x or square here minus here we have four x or is to power three then equals to three from here and here we have four x common we can use a letter to represent that so let the letter t B equals to 4x from here then when we write this equation now then we have 4t squared then minus t cube equals to 3 from here and also from what we have let's take 3 to this side that is we have 4t square minus t cube then minus 3 here equals to zero from here and also from here minus three is same thing as minus four plus one <coughs> excuse me please then when we substitute yeah that as minus four plus one this become four t square minus t cube then minus four plus one now equals to zero from here then let's bring minus 4 together with 40 square so we have 40 square minus 4 then minus here we have t cube plus 1 then equals to 0 from here and what we have here further we can express 4 here as 2 square so that's 2 square then t square then minus here as well as 2 square then minus here we factor minus out we have t cube then minus 1 left which is equals to 0 from here and here this square here we can bring it out and write it as 2t all square minus 2 square here then minus into bracket t cube minus here one can be written as one cube close bracket now equals to zero from here now here we have this together and we have this together then from here the first bracket here follows difference of two squares that is a square minus b square is same thing as a plus b multiplied by a minus b and here this follow difference of two cube a cube minus b cube is same thing as a minus b multiplied by a square plus a b plus b squared then when we apply this then it implies the first bracket a becomes 2t plus 2 then multiply by 2t minus 2 and minus the second bracket here following this we have t minus 1 then multiply by t square plus t times 1 that's t then plus 1 square that's 1 close bracket then equals to 0 from here and also here yeah, we have two common in each of these brackets so we have two out into bracket t plus one here 
then also we have two here that's also times two here out then t minus one left then minus here we have t minus one then into bracket t square plus t plus one yeah equals to zero from here then what we have here two times two that's four so we can write it as four into t plus one then into t minus one then minus t minus one from here then also into t square plus t then plus one close bracket now equals to zero from here and from what we have here we have t minus one common when we factor it out this implies t minus one then into bracket what is left here we have four multiplied by t plus one then minus what is left here we have into bracket t square plus t plus one close bracket then close this bracket now equals to zero on this side that this here we can simplify this bracket and here we have t minus one then into bracket here we have 40 plus 4 the minus open this bracket we have minus t square minus t minus 1 close bracket then equals to 0 from here that is here we have into bracket t minus 1 then here when we rearrange we can write it as minus t square then 4t minus t, that's plus 3t. Then 4 minus 1, that's plus 3. Close bracket equals to 0 from here. Now this here, the two cases we have are t minus 1 equals to 0. Or we have minus t square plus 3t plus 3 equals to 0 from here. Now this taking minus 1 here, here we have c now equals to one on this side then from here let's multiply through by minus one in order to remove this minus and this becomes t square now minus 3t minus 3 then equals to zero from here then comparing this with quadratic equation here a equals to one and b equals to minus three also c equals to minus three then from the formula c here equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus four ac divided by two a that is here c will then be equals to minus minus three plus or minus square root of minus three square then minus 4 times 1 times minus 3 then over 2 times 1 and when we simplify this further this implies we have t now equals to this become plus 3 then plus or minus square root of we have minus 3 squared that's t9 then plus here we have 12 then over 2 from here which implies here that t is now equals to 3 plus or minus root 21 over 2 from here. And what's from what we have now, we have from here t equals to 1 or t equals to plus 3 plus or minus root 21 over 2. Now recall that we represented t as 4x so since we represented t as 4x it implies here that 4x is now equals to 1 and to get x here we have divide both side by 4 then this cancel out and x here equals to 1 over 4 then also from the other side here 
we equate t as 4x which is equals to 3 plus or minus square root of 21 over 2 and here we can to get x we can just multiply by 1 over 4 on both sides that is here this cancel out so this gives us x now equals to 3 plus or minus with 21 over 2 times 4 here that's 8 so here together we have three solutions and which we can write out as x1 equals to 1 over 4 then x2 equals to 3 plus root 21 over 8 and x3 that's 3 minus root 21 over 8 and here are the solutions to this problem thank you for watching don't forget these steps subscribe for more videos turn the description bell on put your comment and uh, share give a thumbs up see you in our next class and bye for now